Hey folks, Wayne Taylor, Honest Home Finder in Harrisburg, North Carolina today, checking out another Eastwood neighborhood. You know I love the product, and this one is just starting out. You can see a lot more white poles than you can, I call it a press board, it's OSB board. The stuff that you can't find nowadays. We're gonna check out the townhomes and the single family. Everything's going up in this neighborhood. I can't wait to work with uh, some of these amazing on-sites. These guys usually treat their clients really well, which makes me happy. As that's the feedback and bounce back that I get. My clients are happy, everything's good. First one we're gonna take a look at on the townhouse side is the Bristol. I should say, I should have said it when I was outside. They haven't opened these up yet for viewing. Um, so they're not completely uh, made up yet. They don't have all the, the foo-foo and the fa-fa on them right yet. We're gonna see them how you would purchase them, which I like. If you've seen any of my videos, you know, I'm like everybody else. I wanna, I wanna walk through the models that are all decked to the nines. A little more fun, um, but realistically, and here on the left is the one car garage. But realistically, uh, it's better to see things kind of bare bone what you're going to be paying for. Well, how many thousands of times, and I'm probably not exaggerating that, but I've had to tell folks not to fall in love with the model because it's a model I am going to show the downstairs water closet. Um, excuse me, uh, townhouse. See the commode just to see the size of it. Some of these things will be different. Not falling in love with the model because they they're not stupid. They they'll spend from tens of thousands and I've seen over a hundred thousand dollars. Now this is in the bigger homes, obviously. Put into their models as they want you to fall in love with their product. That's just smart business. But you gotta keep that in mind. So I do kind of like to come in ahead of time, take a look at things. Got some folks looking on the single family side, but I have sold some Eastwood homes, townhouses before. I've always liked them. Let's get that stuck in my head. There was one build and this was years ago, guys. Builders will change their floor plans. But I loved it. It had the kind of overlooking from the top, like a loft, open loft. So it was really cool. Of course, that's one of those that <laughs> people don't buy, so they change the floor plan. Of course, I like it if nobody wants to buy it. All right, let's head upstairs on this Bristol and see what we have. Made it up, made it up. Look at that banister. And speaking of up, guys, top of the screen, my buyer's incentive. Don't leave money on the table unless you have to. Check out these secondary bedrooms. It's a decent size. Definitely fit a kid in here. It's not huge. Quite frankly, I did not walk in here first, and I'm pulling the spider webs off of me. Always fun. <laughs> uh, they just not a ton of room in townhomes. Most townhomes, I've seen some really big ones and I've seen some really small ones. I don't remember ever being really disappointed by what I was looking at in an Eastwood home. I always enjoyed their process and their quality of workmanship. I feel like I babble on about things like that. Maybe folks don't care for someone in my industry and you're having to deal with the process, how they treat clients, how they uh, take care of problems when they come up, it almost happens all the time. Not everything's perfect, we're all human beings. But think how things are handled. Is it my way or the highway or is it let's look into this? If we can help you out, we will. This bathroom is not normally that dark, that light just won't come on. You can see the blue punch tape. So these aren't finished, like I mentioned when I walked in the door. I care about the attic, there it is. I got a kick out of this. They got these things in here fast, or at least one of them. 
washer and dryer. Can't find these things for hella high water nowadays or you know a big waiting list. Nice big linen closet. Primary bedroom. Where the important people live, man. It's the ones paying the bills. Give yourself a pat on the back if you pay all the bills in your household. Or half of them. Any of them. But you're not a little money pit kid, right? I like to teach my friends about that. Please don't take offense. I got a big soft spot in my heart for children. As long as I'm not taking care of them. You can charge extra for shots of me, but I'll let you get by with it this time. Commode on the right, that's about all you're gonna get there. I was impressed by this one in the Bristol. A lot of times, master bedroom closets are where they cut some corners as far as space goes. That thing was huge. A shot of this. I like that blue. Just want to put my emails on. Maybe that's why I like Eastwood so much. I think that's their main color. All right, that'll do it. Top of the screen. Don't forget. Thanks, guys.